Welcome back to another day. <laughs> Welcome back to um good Thursday afternoon. The time right now is 16.55. So it's almost 5 p.m. right now and I just came back from town. So there was nothing cute happening there besides G getting done with like errands today running errands on a rainy day and I looked really cute Sanas I look really cute for the up and downs that I was doing today and yeah so I'm just back you guys I had to vlog I just wanted to thank you guys so very much for you know for every like for every subscriber that's subscribe in the month of December you guys thank you so much I just feel like this time around things felt I think quite different I don't know why maybe because I had did I have a project I was busy with last year December I don't think so but then again I think I learned would see I think before vlogmas I need to take a breather and then come back in the month of December and just be ready and prepare as well good to how am I gonna do my vlogs level and not randomly vlog like I was doing um, this year I was just popping up a camera everywhere and I'll have like a bunch of footage and I make it a vlog and always try to make my story make sense and I hope you guys feel the same you get that vibe which I'm trying to create like lifestyle make it make sense and yeah but i think one of my challenges the biggest challenges i've learned is to just always be on my toes and not randomly vlog but instead plan because you remember i had like my nine to five i had vlogs as well after work and i had gym as well after work which i was really committed to so they were tricky you guys but i think i've learned and right now i want to just make sure i make my purchase or my order with ukule yeah with cool and dombela on instagram she's selling weekly planners and i want to get into one because i really want to get into planning i really want to get into like managing my day my weeks my month and my goals and not go with the flow but like monitor literally everything that i planned and put my mind into doing yeah so that's just about it you guys I hope you guys are also planning and preparing for a new year and at the same time taking time to enjoy your holidays and watch our vlogs watch my vlogs subscribe share the video with your loved ones as well and i hope you guys have enjoyed my vlog my vlog and thank you so much for showing me so much love and i want to send a huge shout out to umbali murake i hope i'm saying her name correctly but i'm gonna show you guys her youtube channel as well please do Go to her channel, like and subscribe and like and watch her content. She is a sweetheart. Mbali, you've been a sweetheart. Thank you so much, my love, for showing me so much love and, you know, support in the month of Vlogmas. And she's also just another young YouTuber, uh, you know, in the creator space, YouTube creating space. So, yeah, I'm so grateful and still enjoying you know the growth the challenges that comes with youtube so yeah i've been enjoying the ride it's been a ride it's always a ride get upper 
but yeah i'm really thankful you guys i cannot wait to see what god has in store for me in the next coming year which is just in a couple of days and i'm just like super excited and yeah the times we're living in right now are super tricky they need you to just like build a relationship with god start praying start praying and yeah let's just keep praying you guys we've been losing a lot of young people hence i'm saying times are rough but god is still good god is still intentional so it helps us to connect with a god who knows our tomorrow and that's just the only way we can survive literally every day and have hope for the future and yeah that's just me signing out and i want to leave you guys with the word Ooh, sana scrumsh a scrumsh babe kesana that needs to start editing another vlog right now and that vlog needs to come out tomorrow and i feel like i need like two days for my video but i think that's one thing i need to learn from next year to release a vlog without having too much you know having to think too much about it because that's that's the thing g good to end up seeing too many mistakes because I want I wanted to, you know, I still, I think I'm definitely still going to go to back to town for my room. I need new bedding for this room. I want to take, create like pretty content beside content. I just need like pretty bedding. I want to read you guys one thing. Let me read you guys this. Um, and this is Colossians chapter 3 verse 15 and it reads, And let the peace that comes from christ rule in your hearts for as members of one body you are called to live in peace and always be thankful let the message about christ in all its richness fill your lives teach and counsel each other with all wisdom he gives sing psalms and hymns and spiritual songs to god with thankful hearts and whatever you do or say do as a representative of the lord jesus giving thanks through him to God the Father. I think this was just a reminder yesterday to be thankful at all times. But there's one, okay, yeah. And also to stay rooted in the word, stay rooted in Christ, stay rooted in, in his truth. And you cannot be rooted in Christ if you're not getting into the word. So I think that's just me encouraging you guys as well to fill let the message about christ in all its richness fill your lives wherever you are whatever you do let it be supported by the word of god have a word for the beginning of the new year have a word for for what you're praying for have a scripture that you meditate upon that you're speaking of your life just have a word over everything that you are doing search for that word pray about it read your bibles and have a word and be filled with the with all its richness that it fill your lives that it fill your lives and teach and counsel each other with all the wisdom and you know one thing about God, he's the God of wisdom. And he says in his word, if we do not have, if we lack wisdom, we should go and ask to him who is what? A God who is generous and giving, especially what we need the most. So yeah, that's me. That's the last word of the year 2023 that I'm giving to you guys. Don't forget to be thankful. Always have a thankful heart always go to god with thankfulness that should be our attitude whenever we want to go to prayer but i know there are days where we just want to go crying to god we go to god angry and everything but let's just teach ourselves to trust and just know that god is going to do it and the attitude in prayer is always going to be thankfulness before we even tell him what we need and how you know dissatisfied we are feeling how empty we are feeling but we firstly need to thank him for our lives and the grace he gives us daily and you know for all that we have so yeah that's just me signing out you guys and i had to and i had to share this beautiful word and f let it fill my channel let me fill my family on youtube as well and yeah god bless you guys 
and happy new year i love you lot kesanas and i'm gonna see you guys next year this is me signing out get people love you guys mwah, 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 mwah. <laughs> bye and happy new year Take me there, take me there If what you need is just an offering huh, It's right here, my life is here I'll be a living sacrifice for you You're the fire, You're the, fire. the refiner
Yesu MC Ezwe mapambe ili haleluya
mwanamke wa shupega Ashawa usubre nupe Si You are rest assured Uti We have full usubre nupe Si spirit said you did our love Yes sir Amen 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 We have full usubre nupe Yes Jemo kos Amen we are queens and in Yak. Let's raise Konya. And let's keep her as one by nine. We shall swallow it on our pressure. I must find it out. I'll just say, I go step two. Betty, I'll tell us of his policy who step fifty five. I'm not going to say, you call now. Oh, my. Oh, my. In closing. In closing. Yeah, boy. Yeah. Close to your love again. I give my heart again, Jesus. 